Welcome to Woodbridge, the best town around. My name is John McCormick. I'm the mayor of this great town, and we're here tonight for some very special proclamations for some very special citizens of Woodbridge Township. I'd like to start by calling up a seven-year-old young man. His name is Noah F. Noah. Is that your real name or your stage name? Is that your real name? No, I didn't think so. You want to tell me what your real name is? Or you, you don't want to? You want to? Noah Fatala. Noah Fatala. Okay. Is that what the F means? Is it Noah F. Noah? The F's for Fatala? All right, well, turn around. you got your 15 minutes of fame. Make sure you get it all on camera. Now, Noah, as I said, is seven years old. He's a judo athlete. He's a Colonia resident. He was number one, not in the town, not in the county, not in the state. Number one in the United States of America competition. For his division of weight. In case you didn't hear me, that was the United States of America. Uh, Noah represented, re represented the United States judo team in Toulouse, France, and he's a two time national and international competition champion. His mother's with him today, Emne Asale. And here, let me take this down and let you tell me a little bit about what this is all about, man. Just start talking. Look at the camera. <laughs> tell me all about your, your life so far. Mm. When did you just start doing judo? Uh, when I was when I was three. Okay, why did you start? Wait, no, four, four. Four. Why did you start doing judo? Someone told us about it. Okay, and what made you think you might like it? Did you just go one day and, and like fall in love with it and say this is for me? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Why? Are you, I mean, obviously you're good at it. Were you good as soon as you tried it, or did you have to get good at it? Mm. Did you just like say, wow, this, I'm good at this already. I can be really doing this, you know? I was good at it. You were good at it early? Okay. And did you get your teeth knocked out in judo? No. No? They just, they just fell out because you're a seven-year-old kid? Yeah. <laughs> What's it like taking a big plane all the way over to France to compete? Getting hungry. Getting hungry. <laughs> now I, I feel I feel like we're like we're together here because I'm the best mayor in America, and you're the best judo kid in America. Yeah. We have a lot in common. We're both the best in the whole country. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Tell me what else you want to say. What what was like being? Um, I mean, you're the best in the in the country. Right? There's billions of people in the country. You're best. What's that feel like? Good. Good? It's got to feel great, like Tony the Tiger, man. What do you like most about judo? How much do you have to practice? Answer that question. How much do you have to practice? Mm, a lot. Like typical day in the summer, are you practicing every single day? Yeah. And where do you practice? Judo. Where? No, what part of the town? Like in a gym? Where's the gym? Gym? Well, like, where do you where does he practice at a gym? Uh, no, at uh, Kamal Judo. Oh, the Judo Academy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Patterson. Where? Patterson. Patterson. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tell me more about it. What? Do you have any brothers and sisters? Mm, yeah. Brothers. Yeah. Brothers. How brothers. old are they? Twelve and, thir and thirteen. Did when they have fights at school, do they call you up to go <laughs> help them? <laughs> and they say, "Come here, little bro. Come here, Noah. This kid's bothering me. Can you take care of him?" No, no, only one kidding about that part. What else you want to say? Deb, you want to, you're from, what part of Colony are you from? What's your, what's your street name? <clears throat> Where? Neptune. Oh, Neptune Place. Okay, come on, this is your councilwoman. So in 11 years, you can vote for her. <laughs> and then in 11 years, you can vote for me too, because we're both still going to be here. And this is Corey. Good job, man. congratulations. And that's Liz Beth. Look at this hardware. <laughs> so how blessed are you all? Liz Beth speaks Spanish. <laughs> he, they're Lebanese and Egyptian. Oh, Lebanese and Egyptian. Oh, I, I, didn't know, I didn't, I'm sorry, I didn't know you were speaking there. I'm sorry. All right, so tell me, last thing you want to say, all the kids out there watching, they're like young like you, they want to do something, they want to play something, they want to be good at something. What would you tell them? You know what I tell people? The secret to success in life? Find something that you're good at, that say, you like doing. I was going to say stop copying me. Stop copying me. <laughs> Give you this proclamation. <laughs> no, seriously, the secret to life is find.
finding something that you're really good at, that you love doing. Because you can be really good at something, but you don't like it, and then you're not going to be successful at it. Or you can really like doing something, but you're no good at it, and then you're not going to be successful. So you really like judo, yeah. and you're really good at it, and that's why you're successful. All right, deal. Yeah. So let's